now for something completely different. We've got a little adventure ahead of us today. We're going to go to shore and then we need to find a post office. And we're also going to wander around Nassau a little bit to see the sights while we're here. The reason we need to go to a post office is because I just finished this painting which I am going to send off today and <laughs> it's it's a really fun one so I'm excited to give it to Mark and if you guys want portraits or pet portraits I am happy to do them for you. The opportunity to paint in the boat from these commissions is a really big gift for me because it's my true passion. So if you'd like to commission a work of art, you can go ahead and email me with the email address that's in the description down below. It's been raining and cloudy pretty much non-stop the last few days and it's not supposed to let off uh, for another week. So we're kind of just forced to deal with it. All right, it's gonna be about a half mile journey to the place where we are actually allowed to dock our dinghy. <laughs> place we tied up was not legit so we came in here to this marina and we've tied up here it's gonna be a small fee but I think it'll be worth it for the day Those of you guys who are admirals and up, we send you postcards from our ports of call. And sadly, the past few ports we've been in don't have postcards or mail or anything. So we're here in Nassau and we're on the hunt for postcards, which are ironically hard to find in such a tourist place. So we're heading down to the cruise ship island strip where all the tourist trap stuff is and we should be able to get some postcards for you guys. amount of stairs as the years that Queen Victoria reigned. She was coronated at age 18 and this was a spot where slaves were forced to dig and uh, through this canyon and so when Queen Victoria freed the slaves they wanted to commemorate her in some way so they built this staircase. Fort. A real fort. Yeah, so we 
got d dropped off at the post office, and it turns out that they're closed in the afternoons because they're closed. Uh, even though online it says they're open. So we got dropped off there, and then we're like, we still need to mail this painting, so we need to get to a post office of some sort. So we looked up, and there's a UPS about two miles away. So we started walking. Well, first we went to the Queen's staircase yeah. and everything, and then we started walking to this UPS. Now, it took us all out of the tourist area and everything into like the real Nassau, and then suddenly like a lot of people were staring at us and we were going through, and then this woman shouts out her car, it's not safe for you to be here. Yeah. So, uh, then it turns out there were three taxi drivers that were kind of like keeping an eye on us, and <laughs> like watching us, so they picked us up. Uh, they t one of them took us for free over to the UPS, just finished our journey, and then the other guy waited outside to take us back. <laughs> yeah, and at the UPS store when we told them that we'd walk, they, they were, were like, like, oh, what? oh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they said, this is the ghetto. But it's funny because it, we're just, I guess we're naive. It didn't seem like a ghetto to us. So now we're back in town. We've been shown a lot of good kindness. I'm sure nothing would have happened to us, but it was... It was nice to be shown that they, they care and they uh, They're looking out for us. <laughs> are looking out for us. We were going to head out today, but it's extremely windy and there's a marina nearby that'll give us a chance to do some laundry and we desperately need to do laundry. So, we're gonna take today to do laundry <laughs> and uh, restock our food stores a little bit and then we'll be heading out tomorrow. Are finished we did our laundry we filled our fuel jugs and we got a bunch of groceries from the ship store so somehow we now need to fit humans into this dinghy <laughs> Doing. Cutting to murders. What for? Dinner. And what's for dinner? Tomatoes and burrata. What you making? Caprese. Yes. So why do you like burrata instead of mozzarella? Because burrata is literally mozzarella with mozzarella inside of it. <laughs>
Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, yeah. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends. And if you'd like to follow our journey in real time on a map, receive postcards from our ports of call, and message us directly to the boat, you can go ahead and become a patron using the link in the description down below. And now, something completely different. And now, for something completely different. How are you so bad at this? Oh, what I said? No! <laughs> what is it that I'm supposed to say? You're saying, and now something completely different. You're supposed to say, and now for something completely different. And now, for something completely no. different. What? <laughs> You're like, and now, for something complete. It's, and now for something completely different. And now for something completely different. And now for something completely different. Why do you pause after saying now? And now for something completely different.